Squarespace is one of the largest domain registrars in the world, period. And so there's going to be a lot of people, whether they even have a Squarespace site or not, using Squarespace domains as their main area to host their domain. So if you want to change your DNS records, how do you do it? So you join me here on my account dashboard. And to get to that, you need to go to account.squarespace.com. Now in here, you'll see dashboard and you'll see domains. If you click on domains, you'll see a list of all the domains that you have access to. So obviously a ton of these are client websites, but if I go into the search bar, I can look for by Crawford, which is obviously one that I own. So you'll see the status, so whether it's active, you'll see the provider, so is it Squarespace or a third party, and the expiration date. So I'm gonna click into here, and on the left, you'll see overview, DNS, website, email, permissions, and billing. What we want for DNS is obviously the DNS. So under here, you'll see your settings, name servers, name server registration, and DNS SEC. So if we start up at the top, we've got email campaigns here. I have an email campaign, a Squarespace email campaign subscription. Then you've got your Squarespace defaults. So if it's hosted with Squarespace, you don't really need to change uh, these records here. Google Workspace, if you have that, and then custom records. So I'm in the way here. But if you want to add records in, all you need to do is click on add record. You can then do your host. So put in your data here, the type. So whether it's A, C name, whatever it is, TXT, MX. I can't lie, I'm actually not familiar with any of these ones. But the main ones are going to be your uh, A records, your C name records, MX, and then TXT. You can set the priority and then the data in here. So really simple, once you're happy with that, you'll just hit save and that will go into your DNS settings. Obviously you've got other bits and bobs under DNS, but in this video, I just wanna focus on the main thing, which is adding records into here. So hopefully you found that useful. And if you did, please make sure to leave a like and hit subscribe. And if you want me to build your Squarespace website or update your DNS records, you can get in touch using the links in the description.